My name is Xu Xinming from Fudan University. I will introduce the paper submitted to AMETA recently. The title is Infant Age Inversely Correlates with Gut Carriage of Resistant Genes, Reflecting Modifications in Microbial Carbohydrate Metabolism During Early Life. The infant gut microbiota are recognized as reservoirs of antimicrobial resistant genes, and one study found that 40% of detected ARGs found in the infant gut confer resistance to multiple antibiotics, including resistance to drugs to which infants had not been exposed. We aim to study the infant gut resistance natural assembly, including identify factors that influence the trajectory of resistant development using publicly available metagenomes from infants and toddlers. Our findings present a landscape of the infant gut resistance, which will lay the foundation for studies in developing strategies to mitigate the problems of antimicrobial resistance. To assemble a cohort of global infant gut metagenomes, we retrieved more than 4,000 infant and toddler-related metagenomes from 963 infants in 17 independent studies between 2015 and 2020. We applied unified quality controls and upstream analysis to all samples. Full-term infants who were vaginally delivered without any recorded antibiotic treatment were categorized as healthy in our analysis. 858 stool metagenomes from 272 infants during the first 14 months of life were used to capture the natural assembly of healthy infant gut microbiota. We next examine the fecal resistance in healthy infants, consistent with the gradually changing microbial community. We observed gradual changes in the infant resistance with increasing age. Of the resistant types included in the MegaRays database, the drug resistant types was the most frequently observed, followed by metal, multi-compound, and biocide resistant types. Overall, resistant to tetracyclines and drug biocide were, were the most common antimicrobial resistant phenotypes in the developing infant guts within the first 14 months. The increasing complexity of the infant gut microbiome is accompanied by a decline in the absolute abundance of resistant genes, suggesting an uneven distribution of these resistant genes across microbial taxa. By assigning a microbial taxon to the resistant gene containing context, we found that Pseudomonadota was the dominant resistant related phyla, which harbored 3,720 unique resistant genes, representing half of the infant gut resistant overall abundance. The resistance from Ischertia was dominated by drug biocide resistance and multimetal resistance. Next, we extended our analysis from healthy infants to all metagenomic samples to explore the factors influencing the infant gut resistance. We further applied a random forest model to identify time-specific signatures in the resistance. The developing gut resistance was linearly related to infant biological age. To decipher the underlying mechanism of the age-dependent assembly of infant gut resistance, we attempted to identify the resistance genes that exhibited significant correlations with age in terms of their abundance. Overall, 110 genes were grouped into six clusters with two distinct dynamic patterns. To gain insight into the influence of carbohydrate metabolism on resistance, we proceeded with in-depth functional profiling analysis that observed six classes of carbohydrate active enzymes. Furthermore, we examined the association between the 110 H-associated MEG-IDs and the 83 H-associated KZ enzymes and found that half of the possible MEG-ID KZ pairs were significantly correlated. Variation in resistance abundance due to carbohydrate metabolism was greater than the variation due to microbial composition. We next examine the prevalence of acquired resistant genes in all infants with RISFinder version 4. The overall abundance of transferable genes were significantly associated with infant age. Consequently, we observed a gradually increased level of acquired resistant genes in infant gut resistance over time. We further expanded our analysis to predict the occurrence of lateral gene transfer events in infant gut microbiome. As measured by LGT events per microbial taxon, transfer frequency gradually increased over time. Here is the summary of our study. This is end of our presentation. Thank you.